Yes, we're back with the other team. Yeah, okay. I knew they were big fans. I knew they were big fans. The tea party. Two thirds of the tea party. And uh, Stuart right here. And uh, Jeff right over here. Stuart, Jeff, everybody. Everybody. Welcome back to the Much Environment. It's a pleasure. It's been a few times. It's been a few times. You've been here a, a number of times. Now, uh, let's talk about, first of all, bit, some big news. Uh, in January at the Sky Dome. The stones are closing for us. The stones are closing for you. <laughs> the stones are closing for you. Unbelievable. Two shows, actually. Sky Dome yeah. and in Montreal. Yeah, we're giving them about 90 minutes. <laughs> At the end of it all, we'll let them do some encores. Yeah, we'll let them do some encores, and then you know, Fantastic. You full guys... lights. We're gonna give them full lights. So. Yeah. Give them full lights too. <laughs> and they, they've agreed to this. They don't yeah. mind at all. Mm -hmm. No, not at all. Maybe you'll bring Mick out to. Uh, yeah, we're thinking about. Do it. the river with you, maybe, we're maybe not. It's, we're thinking about. Think, it. Okay, yeah. still negotiating. I sent him the words, so he's just going it over right now. But Fantastic. it's words like sticks and all that. He just. Uh, <laughs> really... As well as that, uh, you, you're, you're on your own tour. Uh, playing tonight in uh, in Toronto at the warehouse tomorrow night. tomorrow night since I'm on this uh, topic of dates let's go over the dates shall we do that right now do you mind everybody do you know the dates so far yeah. you all going to the show tonight you got your tickets already tonight tomorrow at the warehouse uh, Ottawa uh, November 8th at Congress Center with uh, Caroline Crush and Glue Lake mm -hmm. Winnipeg Convention Center November 21st November 23rd Saskatoon November 24th Calgary uh, November 25th Calgary as well McEwen Hall mm -hmm. Nice place. Don't know. Have we played there? Have you played there? No. You're doing two shows there. A lot of fans in Calgary. There we go. A lot of Tea Party fans. Edmonton, Alberta, uh, November 26th, November 28th, uh, Kelowna and Victoria, November 30th. And you were telling me as well about the show... In Vancouver. In Vancouver at yeah. the P&E. P&E. &E. The Pacific National Exhibition. That's the one. When's that one? Because yeah. I, I don't have it here. We got a date on that? Where's, where's our... Man? We got a date on that? Uh, we'll get that date. We'll get yeah. that date in there. So how do you guys feel, first of all? You, you've done your own tours. Uh, but opening for opening for the Stones, or playing, sorry, playing with the Stones. <laughs> opening, <laughs> opening for the Stones. We, it's a great thrill, you know. It's something that, uh, especially when you're a kid growing up, you're like, you always see these big stadium concerts, yeah. and you know, yeah. it's like just the, the awe of it, the spectacle of the whole thing. And then to actually be a part of it at a certain point, it's, uh, you know, it took a while to sink in, you know, really. Big Stones fans? Yeah, well, you know, there were certain records I was, Big fan of like Exile on Main Street. Yeah. Satanic Majesties, like older stuff. Yeah. Psychedelic stuff. Because you know we're a satanic band. Oh, yeah. So they, uh... they just don't get too close, right? <laughs> so they have like at least what, 35, 36 albums, I guess? I think so, yeah. Think Is that so. right? Got some catching up to do. Yeah, we got catching up. <laughs> I gotta bring up a point here now, because last night while I was sleeping, I was having a tough time sleeping because I knew I was gonna be talking to you guys today. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, was, I had this dream that I was in this hotel and some guys were chasing me. And then the pizza man came to drop off the pizza. So it looked like the Babylon video. <laughs> and the next thing that happened, you came to my rescue. You swang, you were just swinging in. You, you were swinging in on the cable. Oh, that's right. And you're my hero, so thank you very much. Oh, I appreciate that. Or else, or else I wouldn't be here talking that's to you That's what we today. make videos for, <laughs> right? you know? Totally. But let's talk about that video, because there's a lot going on. Um, Certainly was. I've jotted a few things down. I'm just going to mention a few. A girl branding another girl, someone talking to, uh, taking a bath, a guy receiving oxygen, uh, guys uh, carrying barrels, ravers in the corner, you got old ladies painting uh, younger fem uh, males, guys with fencers' uh, helmets. Does this all make sense? It didn't make sense when we were doing it. <laughs> you missed the roosters. There was like there chickens were, everywhere. There were chickens yeah. everywhere. Live livestock. Like there was, what else was there? Ladies with the Ladies with I the mean, goats. it's not a rock and roll video without livestock. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Really. <laughs> <laughs> but it's very cool because all these different ideas and it's a, it's a one take sort of thing, right? Yeah, we actually, I think we went through it about 34 30 times. times. 34 times? Yeah. So I got hoisted up on that thing 34 <laughs> times. I went back home and it was Action the old heroes, uh, <laughs> Epsom salt bath thing going down. Fantastic video, fantastic song. Do you guys, uh, you guys are, you're, you're hanging out. Do you have any questions for the guys? Do you have a question right here? What's your name, first of all? Uh, it's Melanie. Melanie? Sarah. Melanie. And Sarah right here? Okay. You guys, uh, go ahead. Um, well, we know that you guys have been touring everywhere around the whole world, and mm -hmm. uh, we just wanted to know what was the biggest aspect of influence for you while you were touring? Like in the different places. Culture. Yeah, different cultures. Yeah. I think Turkey was probably... Turkey the most was enriching place. Yeah, that would have. Because you did happened. your video there, right? Uh, for yeah, bizarre. we did the bizarre there. I mean, that's what we try to do when we're on tour. Um, try to be as empirical as possible. You know, like go for the experience of it all. Yeah. So as opposed to just like staying on the tour bus, we try to get out and try to meet people and try to you know infiltrate society, so to speak. You know? 
So what was it about? Good question. What was it about Turkey then? Well, we uh, we picked up more instruments there, and Did you? each night we hung out with like these gypsy musicians who would actually teach us proper technique. Oh, cool, so cool, you cool. know, it'd save us a couple of years. Which we forgot. <laughs> <to do this. laughs> Too bad you couldn't bring them back with you. Eh? Uh, <laughs> Put them the in musician. the closet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still scratching it. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone else? Have, there's someone uh, over here, right here. Well, you pass along there, Melanie. What's your name? First of all, I'm um, Shana. Sheena? I was just okay, wondering, um, I know you like, said you liked the Stones a bit. I was just wondering what other bands inspired you when you were growing up? Um, a lot of things, you know. Um, as, as far as being a guitar player, when I was learning to play guitar, it was like Jimi Hendrix and Jimmy oh, yeah. Page. I also liked Joy Division a lot as a band. That's a pretty big influence yeah. on me. Stu? Also English stuff like uh, The Jam, Cure, you know, Echo and the Bunnymen, stuff like that. So. Level 42? Not particularly. Perry Como? Frank Sinatra? No. Sinatra, Frank, maybe. Frank, yeah. For sure, Frank. I think Frank influences everybody. Well, it's that baritone thing, you yeah. know? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sympathetic with that. Blue eyes, man. Blue eyes. <laughs> now, is Jeff? Jeff obviously isn't here. No. Is he, uh, is everything okay with him? Is he, uh... Is He's he... recouping. He puts so much into the shows, I think. Yeah, so, yeah. 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 Physical exhaustion. You just played last night somewhere? Yes, we did. We played London last played night. London. Great show. Nice. Okay. All right, so, you know what I'm going to do? First of all, I'm going to hold up this and uh, let you guys know out there that this is uh, still available. Right? It's still available in stores now, and uh, I'm not going to turn this around because uh, these girls are... <laughs> we'll just put this back down, and, okay? <laughs> and this would be our, our next record, <laughs> right here. You lost a lot of weight, eh? Yes, I have. Yeah, yeah, right. There you go. New we're haircut and everything. We're sending this one out to uh, everyone who's, uh, who's been to the shows already, everyone who's going to the show tonight, and uh, the following shows um, across Canada, and, uh, and to Jeff. Who's, uh, is that okay? Yeah? You like that right there? Fine, all right. All right, guys? Any, any last words to your uh, fans here? Enjoy the show. Thank you. No, no, any, any last words from, from you guys to these guys? <laughs> yeah, I, just, I guess they're never our last words because you'll always be back. I would just say just keep believing in us, you know? We'll never let you down. That's pretty much about it. Fantastic. Thanks for coming to Bye, guys. Uh, you guys have fun tonight. Uh, Thank these, you. These, this will be the video Babylon Tea Party. Yeah.